Okay, I was running out of time, so I had to split the videos in half or, you know, up so that I can upload quickly. So at this other store, and I don't remember the name of it. Oh, I'll have a card here somewhere. It's Darcy's Heart and Home. Darcy's Heart and Home. Okay, so here's the card, and they're out of Ohio. Um, I'm going to, let me take this out because I want to, to kind of, not show something that I got as a gift for a friend. So let me make sure I don't show that because I want it to be a surprise. Sorry guys. Not prepared. Okay. That's okay because that's mine. There's a website. I don't know if you guys have seen this before, but this is the first time I've seen them. So I was like, oh, I got to get some of these. Put on top. I don't know okay they gave me a whole bunch of stuff okay so what it is is um, these these guys they make these stamps and I'm sorry about the wrinkling you're just gonna have to deal with it or you can just pop out of the video that's not gonna hurt my feelings at all okay they have these stamps like this is that right they have these stamps like this. that's probably not a good example because I don't have the matching thing right here um, like this Penguin, right? See? They have these stamps like this. And then they have these matching flare buttons. And what you do is you take that flare button and you pop it over the face of the stamp after you've colored it. So it's kind of like a 3D effect. And this is the photopolymer one. They have rubber too. And I don't, I think I did get a rubber one here. I got this one in rubber. Cute, right? So you, so here's the colored image. You would just take one of the faces that match like this guy and you would pop it over her face here and she would have like a 3d effect so um i got these two and i thought i had another stamp here i might have it's just in the bag or something um oh no um yeah so i got a couple of the pin the the tin pins is what they call them and then i got a couple of the heads and notice I'm preparing for Christmas already. Penguins. 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 Lots of penguins. Okay, so I got some of those. I got this little whale stamp because it was half off. So that made it $4.20. $4.20. Cute. I like the little heart. <laughs> so I got that. They gave me a catalog. And I also got this. This was a multi-pack. And what it comes with is it comes with a CD that you can print out on shrinky dink paper. They had all these little shrinky dinks that they had done. And you could actually, that was the make and take. You could cut out a, a shrinky dink. She would heat it up and it would shrink, you know, down. And then you could put the little tin pin on it. And then you could, you know, make a magnet out of it or something. But it has all of these little shapes um, that you can print out on the CD. And then all of these little um, characters. So this is the winter one. So what I got was a fall winter um, themed pack. And I know that Linda got a different one. She she had some cute ones too. So I got the penguins of course. And the snowmen in, are in here. And then there's some sentiments even. And then you get some for Halloween. I don't think I'll ever make the Halloween ones because I don't really do Halloween. So um, I thought these were adorable. See look at these. Whoops, I hit the camera. So this was a pack. Um, that they had, you know, a show price for. And I also got a um, catalog for that. So I'm going to put these back away because I kind of want to keep them together for now. Whoops. Oh, boy. Bend it over. Okay. So there's that store. And I, did I show you this one already? That's a muse. And keep on going. Okay, um, the other place I went to, um, oh, this is from the actual um, scrap store that I stopped at um, as well. And um, I didn't really buy anything too much there. I bought one of these. Now, I bought the, what do you call that thing? EK Tools um, bow maker that they had at Joann's. Uh, I have yet to use that. But I thought this would be a good idea to have too because you don't have to have those um, 
special pins that they use in theirs. Um, this is the bow maker from Clover, and you could probably just use a brad to go through this because this doesn't use that kind of thing. See how it, um, here on the back. On the back it shows you what size bow it makes, and these are the different um, tools you get in there. And this is the one that is, you know, like your typical ribbon, large size. It's four inches wide, and um, it has instructions on how to, to do this. So, um, because I couldn't find the refills for the EK tools, I'm sure they'll sell it online at some point, but hey, whatever. It was only five. Five ninety five, and they gave me ten percent off my total today because I went to the show, and um, I also got the new stickles colors. Um, I there's twelve new stickle stickles colors, and I did not get them all. <laughs> surprise, surprise! Look at this blue, guys. That's blue. It's called uh, yeah, yeah. sea glass. Sea glass emerald or something shamrock um gun smoke uh enchanted look at the purple it's almost like the color no it's not even the color of the bag it's a different color I lied i lied um raspberry tart uh oh this one's pretty cool mint okay can you pass that up i don't know anybody can pass this up cool mint and then um blue bayou so I did not get the one that was um, pineapple. It's a yellow color. They have an orange that I didn't get. It's a yellow orange and they had a gold one that I didn't get. There's 12. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That was only three. Yeah, there's two other colors. I don't know what they are. Oh, there was a, it was like a white one. Like they have replaced rock candy stickles, rock candy. They don't no longer make that one with another color that's very similar or another, another one that was very similar. So I was just like, whatever, don't need it. Um, cause I had plenty of rock candy and then, yeah, there was a, a bunch of other, other colors I didn't get cause I didn't think I'd use them. So that's what I got at that, um, scrap store. I got one die from Ellen Tina and she's at all of this lady. I don't know if you guys have ever seen this lady. She's at all the shows I've ever seen wh where they're at. Cause it's like a home business, not a home business. It's a, um, it's uh, you know, a small business and it's called Tesla. Tesla Stamps and Stencils Company. Um, and this is instructions on how to do your um, sandwiches. But I don't need that. But this is a <laughs> this is the die that I got. Look how cute these are. They're Rudolph. I, I hesitate to say that. But if you look at this die, it looks just like Rudolph would in the old cartoon. Cartoon? No. Clay, clay claymation? Claymation um, that they did? This was not cheap. Look how much that was. But that's the reason why I only bought one die from there because um, her dies are not cheap, but she has other dies. So I got these two guys in here. And I'm going to love it at Christmas time. I hope I remember I have these. So if you want to see these cut, leave a message um, in this, in, you know, leave a message down below, leave a comment. Uh, Stampers Anonymous was also at the show. Oh my God. I could have gotten a lot of trouble there, but I didn't. I was pretty good. Um, so Stampers Anonymous. Um, they have a web special. There's my receipt. And I, instead of getting the, all the new stencils, I only picked up the ones that I wanted that I hadn't gotten yet or were new. You know, so this one, I hope I don't have this. Gothic. This is the holiday knit. Um, Scribbles, this is a new one. They had two um, show packs and one of them had six, six or something like that and the other one had six and I didn't like them all so I was just like I'm picking and choosing the ones I want. This one, they had this one is Flourish and then this one is Lace and I think these last few ones are new, these last three. The other two I think were re released last year, I believe. I could be wrong. I don't know. And then I went ahead and picked up this guy, which I don't think I actually... I've, I've had this in my cart for a few days now. They had this. Um, this was the last one. So this is the new Tim Holtz um, coffee cup die. 
and um, it's called Fresh Brewed. It's at 80%, so the, the actual cup is, is a little bit bigger than what you're seeing on the front. Why did I have to have it? I don't know. I had to have it. They gave me some, what do you call it? They gave me a catalog of stuff for Tim Holtz that came out at CHA. The Dilutions. I love Dilutions. I almost bought some stamps, but I really... Dina Wakely. Oh my god. Um, Brett Weld, Weldell. I don't know how you say his last name. And then, of course, Wendy Beachy. So, I love the stuff that they released, but I was just like, you know what? I'm going to wait until Joann's has it so I can get it for 40% off. Except for that die. And then, Linda, Linda saw this, and we we got to talking, and we were like, is this a good price? Two inch soup wedding tape. Two and a half inch, sorry. <laughs> it's a score tape for $21. I don't know if that's a good price or not. But this should last a long time. It's a two and a half inch roll. And it's 27 yards. You might, I think you probably could find it cheaper if you were really looking for it. So that was my haul, two videos. And I had fun meeting up with Linda. Linda, if you want to meet up again, just let me know. We'll probably have to do the um, next expo or something like that together. Um, so thanks for watching, guys, and have a good one. Talk to you soon. Bye now.